Today we're taking a quick look at the Sheffer Image Wave Rave boat with connected inner tube. It's a child's toy. It's a boat RC electric, all electric. It has a built-in battery. You charge via USB-C port on top and it requires four AA batteries in the controller. My son's about six years old and he does have some RC experience. So he's been able to take to it like a fish to water. Pretty cool little boat. It also comes with a little tow behind inner tube that honestly helps slow the boat down if the kid doesn't quite grasp the controls and how to work. Without the inner tube, it does about a fast walking pace, so three, four miles an hour. And by attaching the little inner tube, it'll drop it down another just to like two miles an hour. Very easy and manageable for the kid. Four AA batteries in the controller. It's on when the switch is up and off when the switch is to the side. When it's on, there's actually a little glowing light in here that you can see just not in the middle of the daytime. It's got two propellers on the back and the boat will not work until these two metal contacts connect with the water and that closes the circuit. That allows it to get some energy. See that? It won't, see, watch. It won't work unless it's in the water. You charge via USB-C cord that plugs right into the top here. And it took a little over two hours to charge completely. So the battery lasted about 10 minutes of active driving. When the battery was dying, it felt like it lost radio signal, so the boat would just kind of stop for a second. When you release the trigger and push it again, it would go again. And that's kind of indicating that the battery is getting low and that you should bring it back to shore. So you may need to go, stop, go, stop, go, stop. And you cannot put new batteries in this. Um, it's plastic is all sonic welded, and so you can't change the battery. You are just stuck with what's inside and the current charge that's there. So that would probably be the one downfall of this little boat is that after 10 minutes of ripping around, you're gonna have to stop. The propellers on the bottom are plastic, so they could break. It did come with two spare propellers if they did happen to get damaged during the play. At the price point of around $25, I gotta say, it's a decent little RC boat for the kids. It's not too expensive if they do happen to lose it in the water because the range is still only around 50 feet, depending on where you're standing compared to the shore. If you're on a dock, you may get better range, but 25 bucks is kind of worth it for me so far, and he's having a blast. So what do you think about the Wave Rave boat? I think it actually works pretty good. Yeah, does it go fast enough? Uh, yeah, with the left. Up to yes, but with the not the left. After I think I'll take take it when and and I'm when I'm the, when I'm older and I know how to control this thing better. Uh -huh. I think I'll go without the left, but the left helps me slow down. Yeah, are you able to control it pretty good? Yeah. Do you understand the controls? Yeah. Is yeah. it is it pretty easy to control? Cool. Well, that's a quick review on the Wave Rage from Sharper Image RC boat for kids. I would recommend it at that price point, and I think he would too. Thank you so much for watching. Keep looking past.